To be a competitive athlete, you have to push your body to the limit because the other athlete that's competing against you is trying to push their body to the limit. And so the key to, to, to avoid injury is knowing when you're reaching that limit and when to back off. Um, because, and if you exceed the limit, you'll start to have injury. Repetitive injury mostly because of repetitive stressful in, uh, use of the body. Uh, and knowing, identifying your body's limits and how to basically m train yourself so you can exceed those limits. Well, ACL stands for anterior cruciate ligament. And the knee joint has two crossing ligaments, hence cruciate, uh, that are in the central part of the joint that attaches the thigh bone to the, leg, the lower leg bone, so the femur to the tibia. And the cruciate ligaments are crucial <laughs> in keeping the knee stable. Uh, and the anterior cruciate ligament basically prevents the lower leg bone, the tibia, from sliding out from the upper bone, the femur. So, for example, in a pivoting maneuver or a deceleration or change in direction, if you don't have your anterior cruciate ligament, then your knee can sublux, meaning it can actually slip, jump, and they'll feel it shift and shift back. And if that happens, you can damage the joint surface, the cartilage, uh, or the meniscus, which are the pads in the knee joint. And then if that happens, then 10 years, 15 years later, you can have osteoarthritis. So if someone's in their high school career and they start tearing up their cartilage and their meniscus because their knee is loose because they tore their anterior cruciate ligament, they're going to have problems when they're 25 years old or 30 years old, which is relatively young to have a problem. But as far as ligament injuries, like an ACL, that's a traumatic thing. That's uh, there's ways to kind of do prevention programs where you can do certain muscle strengthening, things like that. But overall, stressing your body and getting the most out of your body requires being tuned into your body, understanding recovery time, uh, nutrition, um, and, uh, and how, how to move forward.